Got things to do today. We're doing core, core, yes, core and more. Everything is core. We are gonna cover 360 all over core, everything supporting core muscles. What I did this time is I changed up this format a little bit. Everyone hates doing things eight times, so I thought, let's do six, okay? So we're doing Tabatas with six rounds, and we have eight, eight Tabatas. Yes, it's not gonna take long. It's only 20 seconds, 10 second rest, and then we are going to repeat each exercise, each exercise six times. It's less sucky than eight, so six is better, okay? Then we're gonna finish up with an obliques core burner. We're gonna count reps, no timer, count reps on each side. So right side, then the left side, and we're counting reps. And we're gonna finish it up, everything else. Now for the Tabatas, I am using five pound dumbbell um, or dumbbells. Uh, you can also use threes, uh, you can use your ones. Um, you wanna make sure we're gonna have fast, quick motion. So obviously if I'm doing bent over uppercuts, you, you can't grab too heavy. You want to be able to have fast and quick. You don't want to be, you know, delaying with that, uh, using too heavy weight. Okay, so I'm going to start my timer, or what, I mean not start my timer. I'm going to uh, mute my phone. How about that? Get my music ready. There we go. Okay, let's go. Um, I just put the do not disturb on. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna do some crossover knees. And I gotta wait for my beat. <laughs> we'll just do this till I get my beat. Three, four, three, two, one. Repeat the knee. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Same knee oblique. Eight, two, three, six, seven. Cross it over. Eight, two, three. Now side step. One, two, three, four. Knee. Four, five, six, seven. Oblique knee. Cross it over. Six, seven, ten back. Push. Two, three, four. Eight more. Eight, seven, six. Two, aim it down. Stay low. Five, six, seven. Eight more. Eight. Seven. Oh. Four. Three. Two. Side to side. Push. Two. Three. Four. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Two. Aim it down. Tap outside. Three, four more, five, six, seven, eight. Pull the nose front, knees front. Eight, seven, six, drive that knee, four. Three, now front kick. Eight, seven. Six, five, three, two, lean down, back kick. Eight, seven, four, three, two, jabs. Six, seven, eight, uppers, eight, seven, Six, five, two, one, jabs, two, three, four, five, six, seven, uppers, six, seven, eight, hooks, eight, three, four, uppers, 
first eight, two, three, seven, get that core warmed up, two, three, last set, eight, six, seven, twist. Okay, we're good. Let's go. Got my timer ready? I'm grabbing my dumbbells or dumbbell. I'll let you know what I'm gonna do. All right. Now I'm only grabbing one dumbbell. And we're doing twist, twist, twist. It's only 20 seconds. You don't have to have any weight and you can just go stationary and twist for no impact. Okay. 48 rounds, help me count my six, Jen, because I might screw that off. Six of each one. Go. It's only 20 seconds, and then we rest. Done? That's round one. Woo! I think we get 10 seconds rest. Three, two, one, go. Hold that dumbbell right at the shoulders. Twist in the opposite direction. You can swap this out for a chat. Done. I'm already feeling my core because Bar was pretty intense yesterday. I'm feeling my butt, my legs too. Woo! Go! Done. Two more and then we go to the next one. Go! Done. Two more rounds. Oh boy. We have eight of these. Good thing I didn't do it first. I might not have done it. Go! Although I did name this one Tabata Torture with Oblique Finisher. Done. All right, now we're on sex. Go. Then we go to the next exercise. Skier dumbbell swings. I'm grabbing two fives. Done. Okay. Stop and start. Stop and start. Don't grab too heavy. Go, round one. It's little. Stop and start. Don't waste your time doing this. This is gonna take you way. You're not gonna get anything. Use it to, done. Use the weight to get the momentum for the little hop. Stop it at the top, pull it down. Go. These are short, quick bursts. Hinge up the hips. I have stiff arms. It's almost like done. You have battle rope. Slam. 
Set nine. All right, this is round three. Go. Don't forget to breathe. Don't hold your breath. Done. We're on round four. Go. Make it intense. Done. Okay. Two more rounds. Go. One more round. Done. One more. And then I'm going to use one dumbbell for the next one. Go. Done. Okay. Now, hold this dumbbell. Step out here. Lock those 90 degree angle. Twist. Go. Fast. Not the hips. Twist the shoulders. To make it easier, if that leverage is too hard, hold it here. It'll be easier. Holding it out here causes more momentum. Boy, how feel my stomach. I feel my zone like gurgle, gurgle. Oh gosh, done. Okay, John. Woo! John went his hyper speed. Go! Do you feel your stomach contracting? Stopping and starting. This is like doing crunches. Four, three, two, one. Woo! At least we took the arms out of it. Next one, we're not gonna be so lucky. We're gonna have uppercuts leaning down. Okay, round three. Go. Stay upright. Keep those arms locked. Twist the shoulders. Make that weight. Stop and start. Don't do this. Not this. Quick. Fit. Done. Okay, round four. Woo! Round four. Go! Six isn't so bad. Done. Two more rounds. Go. Keep those elbows tight to the body. Woo. Done. Oh my gosh, one more, one more, one more. And then we are gonna use some arm. We're leaning down and doing upper cuts. You want to really feel your core activate when you follow through on the upper. It's not going to be a flurry. A flurry would be using too much arm. I want to use more core. So we're going to go on the emphasis. Done. Okay. Two dumbbells. You're going to lean down. Core. Core. 
core. Let's swing it over to the other side. Follow through with the elbow. Go. Fast, butt. Swing, twist, upper, upper. You're gonna feel it more in your back, towards the back. Butt, you're working obliques. Upper back meets. And roll arm, that was round one. Woo, you can change out your weights. Grab threes, grab ones. Go. Cross over the other side. I love the way this does work your back knee. Done. Round three, right back here, right here. For women, it's like right where your bra strap is. That's the part. Go. So changing the direction, how we're leaning, done. It's gonna target it different. Go. Done. Okay. Two more rounds. Done, one more round. This is 24. Okay. Woo -wee. Next one, I'm gonna use one dumbbell. We're doing alternate slams to the right and left. Done. Okay, it's gonna be, make that, you can use one dumbbell, or no dumbbells, or a three. Stop it, don't let it slam in your leg. Done. If you wanted to do this instead, you can do that instead and take the hop out of it. Go! Done. Go! Done. Okay. Two more rows. No, three more. We're on 28, 29, and on 30. Go! All right, 
We're on the ground for the next one. Go. Okay, one more round. And then we're on the ground, leaning back. Pass, figure eight pass under the legs. One dumbbell, go. Remember the no impact way, Elizabeth. underneath your legs. It's going to be go. Modifiers. Lean back and flutter. Or just like this. Tap, tap, tap. Advance. Just keep your legs lifted and lean back. Done. Ah, uh, That's round one. Don't underestimate that one, done. I'm out of breath from this. Okay, right leg. Woo, this will help for me to remember how many rounds. 
Go! Done. Huh? Three more rounds. Go. One more exercise to go. Fast and quick. Light your weight up. If you're, you can't do fast and quick. Done. Two more rounds. Okay. Ooh. I got a little drips of sweat already coming down. Go. One more round, done. Ah, last one. It's coming up. Go. This reminds me of that little machine they sell where you shake it. Okay, lean back. Alternating crossover modifiers, no weight, lean back. Aim up, aim up. So I'm changing all these directions of twist. You don't have to have the feet elevated. If you don't want to, you, that's a choice. Okay, that was round one, holy moly. Okay, here we go, go. Done. Oh. At least we get to rest, right? Stretch your arms out. Oh. It did go by fast. Go. Done. Oh. Three more rounds and it's over. You can shorten it, have a shorter workout today. After this circuit, you're done. Go. Okay, 
forward. Woo! Straight out. All right, catch your breath. All right, so if you're doing a shorter workout today, hit stop, make sure you stretch, okay? You did a good workout just with that first circuit there. That was 30 minutes of Tabatas. Okay. Woo! Okay. I have five pound dumbbell. And a 15 pound dumbbell. And a 10 pound dumbbell. Okay. We're not timing. We're counting reps. All right. All right. One side, then the other, 16 reps of everything. Now, it's going to be, with the dumbbell if you choose, a jackknife, leg drop, back. Okay? So it's a couple of parts to that move. All right, we're doing 16. Jackknife, leg drop, jackknife down. Okay, five pound dumbbell, let's go. You have to hold it. Five, five pound. We have 16 reps. Three. Modifiers. No dumbbell. Six. Just pull your knees in. Seven. Eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Oh, now, using the dumbbell, you're doing another kind of a chop. We did a chop where I, like I said, this is multi-directional. Every time we lean down different, every time we chop down different. If you want to make it a little easier, Trevor, I forgot to tell you, you can have your elbow up. It'll be easier if with your elbow up. Harder is down. Okay. And then don't forget, just do knee in. Okay, here we go. Yes! I didn't know if you were noticing that. I was turning, were you? 
position. All right, let's catch our breath. We have to do the other side. Yeah, I think I was put a lot of oomph on that twist. Uh, that twist. Here we go.
11, 12, 15, ha, all right, whoo all right, well, we're not done, okay, I'm grabbing a 15, now, I'm going to do a Turkish hinge, I'm going to show you a modification for any shoulder issues, okay, so, typically, dumbbells in this hand, they're going to go down and up, okay, now, Modifiers, keep the weight down here if you want, or no weight, and then just touch the elbow down and come up. So you want to reach that weight under, just reach it under and take the shoulder out of it up here. You can just tuck it under like a thread the needle. It'll still pull your shoulder down towards the front, okay? So you decide what you want to do, or use a lighter dumbbell. All right, 16 on each side. All right, I have my right knee on, dumbbells in the left. Here we go. Control it. Now, of course, if you want to just touch and just do this, you can do that too. Then back to center. Three. Four. Six. The key is don't move that shoulder. Lock it in. Seven. Eight. Ten. Push your hips front on that. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. One more. Ah! Woo! Take it slow. Get your balance first. One. Two. It takes up for me to get warmed up. Three. Seven, eight, ten, thirteen. One more. Ah! Man, by the 14th, I was feeling it. All right. All right, sit up with an over the shoulder chop. Again, now we're going up. Sit up. Up. Sit up. So we're chopping over the shoulder. Now, if you want to do a standing core, you can do this over the shoulder over the shoulder, okay? But we're sitting up. And I got a 10. Okay. Keep it at the shoulder. Go. Sit up. Over the shoulder. Sit up. I don't care about the lower chop, only the upper one. So just sit up. And I bring it to the left side of my knee. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Reach it over the shoulder. Eight. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four, three, two, 
One. Straight to the other side. One. Two. Three. Four. Seven. Eight more.
And everybody who likes a little bit of a time saver when they're in a hurry for work, this will be perfect. Okay, roll it up. Shoulder roll, three, two, we're done. That's a wrap. Stacy, I don't know if you were on the whole time or not. I saw you pop. Martha, it's Martha. Oh, I, I need my glasses. Sorry, girl. Is Martha up there? I, I see Martha. Martha, if you're on there, you better give me a thumbs up. Girl, I was talking to you, and you weren't even here. I didn't know. Okay, peace. Have a beautiful day.